so now we will see input type month in html form so guys basically the input tag along with the type month allows the user to select a month and a year and this we are going to check with the help of examples as well now depending on the browser support a date picker can show up in the input field and we are going to select one of the months and the year as well it is very important to note that the type month is not supported in firefox safari and internet explorer 11 so let us move to the vs code over here and previously we had seen the input tag along with the type file and the type hidden as well now after this hidden input tag we are going to have another input with the type month over here so input colon month as you can see this is the emmet abbreviation over here which is a special feature of the vs code that allows us in order to have the required attributes inside the input tag so guys over here we have the type as month that is set and then let's say we provide the name as month over here and the same value we provided to the id attribute as well now before this we are also going to have the label and for the for attribute we are going to have the id as month over here that's because when the user clicks on this particular label you will be seeing the month picker over here that will be displayed to the user in order to select one of the months and the year so guys over here we will say select a month in this case as the label and then after this input tag we are going to have couple of line breaks over here so that the submit button is showed on the next line now let me just save this file now and try reloading this page on the browser so as you can see select a month label is being displayed over here and then user can click on this particular label or you can also click on this icon over here in order to display the month and the years as well so when we click on the label as well so as you can see over here you can select one of the months in this case so let's say we go back to 2022 and then the month of april we want to select so when we select april 2022 it is being displayed over here and when the user clicks on submit button input field will be passed via the url to the server that's because we have provided the method value as get request over here inside the form tag so guys let us submit this form over here so as you can see the month field is having the value as 2022 and the month that is 04 being displayed over here which is being passed to the server and guys this is the way that we can have the input field with the type month that will allow the user to select one of the months over here the past month or the future months can also be selected in this case so guys comment in the comment section below whether you have learned something out of this video please make sure that you like this video so that it reaches to more people and subscribe to this channel so that you get the notifications on upcoming videos as well the next video that we are going to talk about is input type number in html form so stay tuned